After Ouagadougou in Burkina Faso, where the stakeholders of the region met in November 2018 to make proposals for the sustainability and the surveillance and control system against fruit lives in West Africa, it's here in Dakar, Senegal, where representatives of technical and financial partners, ECOWAS, national committees and national agriculture research system, take stock of the project's achievement after four and a half years of implementations. The workshop of this July 2019 makes it possible to capitalize on the achievements before proceeding with the official closure of the regional fruit fly control projects in West Africa. Fruit flies constitute a major concern for the horticulture sector in West Africa. They can destroy 50 to 80 percent of the fruit productions and limit the West African exports to competitive markets. In order to bring an adequate response to this scourge, ECOWAS established in 2015 a response plan through the project to support the regional plan to control fruit flies in West Africa that the European Union, the French Development Agency, ECOWAS and its member states are co-founding. Uh, I must say that fruit flies have taken place in our ecosystem since the years of 20, 2080s putting therefore a heavy strain on the horticulture sector in Africa and resulting into significant losses that can reach up to 80%, with a heavy burden especially for mango producers exporting towards Union countries. At the Ouagadougou workshop in November 2018, the national project committees were already expressing satisfaction for the level of ownership of the surveillance and monitoring system. In Burkina Faso, we started the surveillance system in May 2017 with 40 mango and orcas at the national level. We also set up surveillance system for data collection. Data are collected on a weekly basis and there is a compilation um, system that uh, enables the transmission of data to the databases. At the regional office level, our system has even been evaluated up to 95% of performance. Among other beneficiary countries of the project, Ghana and Guinea-Bissau also reported the level of ownership of the system. Due to the challenges with the procurement of the surveillance material, we only received our surveillance material in June this year. And we established the national surveillance sites in August. As it is, we may only get one year's data by the uh, end of the project in August 2019. And to do good, do good analysis, you need at least two years' data for you to do analysis of the full fly populations and species that you have in your country. A implementação do sistema de vigilância de mosca de fruta na Guiné-Bissau. Nós recebemos uma formação dos técnicos que trabalham na vigilância e depois já instalamos as armadilhas e recebemos a, a formação como podemos uh, fazer a coleta de dados no terreno. E temos os técnicos que fazem esse trabalho e nesse momento o que nós não temos é que O, não, assist, o sistema não trabalha ainda como deve ser. Fizemos a coleta de, coleta de dados. Today, July 29, 2019, after four and a half years of implementation, significant achievements are recorded on the ground. These results have contributed and positively impacted on the mango sector of the countries benefiting from the project's activities notably by the 57% reduction in mangoes interceptions at Europe's borders and a 40% increase in mango exports from the ECOWAS space to Europe. In the surveillance component, a system is functional, even though it remains to be consolidated. Nous sommes euh, au terme de quatre années et demi de mise en œuvre du projet régional. After four and a half years of the fruit fly control project implementation, we were able to set up a surveillance and monitoring system, which is based on two levels. A regional level, with sampling areas based on the agroecological zones, 
that can sometimes go beyond the borders between member states. The regional system focuses on the large productions basing polarizing several countries. And at the national level, the national surveillance system must be strengthened. At the end of the technical implementation of this project, we recommend that the surveillance tools be able to be the various countries. Countries must still continue to ownership process for the benefit of all development actors such as food producers and exporters. We also recommend that all member states strengthen their national committees so that they can continue the surveillance of their territories. At the regional level, we believe that ECOWAS should recruit staff who must be given the lack of following up the regional system. De suivre le système régional. Achievements are also numerous in the control of fruit flies, though some challenges are still ahead. Parmi Les principaux acquis, nous avons produit. Among other achievements in the control components, a lot of documents were produced, training modules, technical sheets that allow all stakeholders of the subsector to continue benefiting from the project actions after the project closes. Now, taking about recommendations, I personally believe that the most important one is to see how to sustain the project and extend its action to other subsectors of the key importance for the ECOWAS region. I am thinking about subsectors such as tomatoes, citrus, uh, coffees, and coca. We have a lot of producers who work on these sectors. Possibilities are many of other subsectors to learn and build of the experience of this fruit fly control project. The project also contributed in building the capacities of the stakeholders in controlling fruit flies in the region. La composante de renforcement de capacité a permis de former with the capacity of uh, building activities of the project we were able to train many stakeholders more than 23,000 people were trained in surveillance control and capacity, building project speaking, and then we have also the capacities of reference regional laboratory based on the Bobo Julasso in Burkina Faso. We did it with an equipment for fruit flies identification, with identification tools, such that today um, this laboratory has the capacity to identify almost all species of fruit flies that prevail in West Africa. We also produce training modules 37 modules in total at the same time for surveillance, control and capacity building. Today, we have trained more than 990 uh, phyto inspectors who can contribute to improving the phyto sanitary inspections for issues in our prospective countries. Last but not least, we have developed a competence transfer platform that has just been finalized almost at the end of the project. The development of this platform has been completed this month of July 2019 and the project is almost phasing out. So the major recommendation to ECOWAS I have is um, therefore to look for means that sustain the project, get another phase to the fruit fly project so that this components platform can be deployed and functionally tested. There are also several technological innovations developed by applied research for the control of fruit flies. La composante recherche a eu des acquis majeurs au niveau des technologies. The applied research component of the project has reached a lot of major achievements when it comes to the technologies we have developed. We have developed, for example, technologies for biological control, uh, specifically parasitoids that constitute the major achievement of the project and for which we have two laboratories that can produce them in bulk, keep them alive, send them to other countries. Such countries are, for instance, Benin and Burkina Faso. We also have other local products that producers can easily have access to. These products are, for instance, tractors or insecticides that trap flies. In short, I would say we have biological products, natural products that we have developed and that producers can have access to. In terms of capacity building, laboratories have been equipped. We have trained researchers, technicians and producers. We have trained more than 40 students at different levels, bachelors, masters and even PhD levels. Beneficiaries welcome all these results and strongly recommend that ECOWAS and its technical and financial partners find ways and means to give a second phase to the project co to consolidate the achievements and the sustainability of the monitoring and control system. 
I, the only recommendation I will give is that um, the project should be sustained because it has really helped us in Africa and uh, both economically and uh, in every area. So I want them to really help us so that the project can continue and uh, for the betterment of our, of our economy. For the French Development Agency and the European Union who are already financially supporting West Africa through the funding of several projects, it is a renewed pleasure to work with ECOWAS. Globalement, donc, un des résultats du projet, c'est d'avoir permis de réduire... Generally speaking, the major achievement of this project is to have contributed in reducing almost up to 50% of the shipment interceptions at the European borders, which also means that the project has contributed in increasing the incomes of the freight importers. Though we have a lot of achievement for this project, we have also some challenges that, will, that we still need to address. Um, the surveillance system I mentioned earlier is a true model and a very good example. To my mind, I, I don't know a region in Africa that succeeded in setting up such a wonderful surveillance system and broadly speaking, an integrated fruit flight control project. It means that these positive achievements still need consolidations, particularly the surveillance system. It needs consolidation because the project did not have enough time to test it over several production seasons. In the applied research sector, a lot of works have been done and this has allowed to discover some alternative control tools that are environmental friendly, less expensive for producers, some biological control techniques such as the use of uh, parasitoids that trip flights. And all these technologies are encouraging that they still need more um, scaling up for stockholders, producers, so, so we can really reach out the largest expected to this component. Of course, we all know that the research always takes time and we need and have to find this time for the experimentation. These are some of the reasons that push us to look for means to continue these projects. And then we are seriously working on this possibility with the European Union. Nous étudions cette possibilité là ensemble avec l'Union européenne. While appreciating the technical and financial partners for their support to the project, ECOWAS undertakes to enhance and consolidate this pilot project achievement on the ground. For us, it was a pari gagnant, it was a gagnant. For this project, it um, was a big challenge for us and it was a kind of win-win contract and we are very happy with the achievements of the project. And this is because of the project team is a hard-working one. It's obvious that the implementation period of the project is very short. And considering the results achieved so far, we cannot let this project down. The potential of this project is huge. This is reason why capitalization workshop drives us towards consolidation measures and actions. We have already undertaken some discussions and negotiations with our traditional partners, discussions that are ongoing with the European Union and the French development agency for the next step of this beautiful project. This workshop will help us stabilize and all this achievement of the project and take stock of the meaning challenges in a matter that we can quickly start a new phase of this project without too long break in the implementation of these activities. And I would say that uh, we are on a good track, but also you all know that because we have not yet signed a contract with the donor, we cannot start rejoicing. By all means, we are optimistic for a second phase and I'm pretty sure that um, that with the support of our partners we will soon move forward with another compact. With the experience of this pilot fruit fly control project implemented by the Sojourum, Coleap, Bird and Coraf Consortium, ECOWAS has gathered enough significant achievements that enable to adequately undertake a comprehensive management of plant protection against pests with the objective of reducing yield losses, improving producers' incomes, enhancing food security and reducing poverty in West Africa.